Feel. Now watch. So they want to give me the feet, right? So you see how your contact point is out here? Yeah. Hold back. Let it get deeper. How you do that, let the stretch get back further. The further you let the stretch get back, the deeper you let the ball go. Watch. The reason why you're going up, did anybody explain to you why you're going up or no? Look like my, my hands. Can I explain to you why it's oh, happening? Oh, that's right. so, why I'm here. So listen, the reason why you're going up is if you can't create enough space this way, how are you going to have to create space to get to the ball? So I'm going to get to this ball. All right, you can set up. Okay? Now go through and just stop when you're getting your load. Stop. Okay? Now, how are you going to get to that without going here? Go. So, I'm going to get to the Yeah, how are you going to go? Yeah, when you go like that, where's the ball going to go? Go down? Right. Now go back through again and then raise your hands a little bit higher. Like higher, higher? Right where you are doing before. Right above your neck. What I was doing before. Like as in, yeah. Like when you're raising your hands up. Stop. All right, same your elbow. See what I'm saying? Yeah. So the hands up create the space. The ball to work like this. We don't want that. We want to get where? This way. So it's like that stretch here. You're just trying to manipulate the space to be able to get enough room to hit the ball. If I can preset my hands a little bit back further, because you're simple. You're simple with this. You're simple with your hands. Everything's repeatable, right? But the problem is you're trying to manipulate your space. Get the hands back. That's the only reason your hands are going up. So if you get more room this way for your hands to work, the ball's going to be clean. You know what I mean? Set it back a little bit. Yeah, preset them further. Fucking clear your head, look. All you're thinking about right now, preset. Boom. Like pushing back hard. Better. They went up, but not as much. Your hands didn't go up as much. His hands go up as much there? I'm gonna speed up the toss a little bit, the velo. Okay. I'm gonna pick up velo on the toss, all right? That looked clean. That's not up though. That's in the slot where he's starting with the ball. You can't fire from right here, right? So you're just getting next to this. That's fine. Yeah. yeah. Again. Yeah. What was it? Hey, think about it. You're not even, like, getting your legs on. Yeah. I like that, though. All right, one more of those. Yes. First ball I throw him up, he backspins. So that right there is fine. You see how high that ball is? Right, 87, you said 206, you got through it. Not I got on top, you got through it. So your hands can go up from your slot, right? How are they supposed to fire if they're from here? Can they? Low is weird. Right, well, I'm saying, when your hands are preset right here, can you fire from right here? No. Right, so they're going to naturally, oh, yeah. so it's fine. If your hands are going to load up, don't let anybody fucking screw with you. Like, I would fire you, I leave them where they're at, let them, they can fire up. Just careful they don't go past your ear. They go past his ear, and you're done. Oh, dude, where does your hands go? They're going just above your ear, right? Yeah, they, like, sneak up this way. Yeah, but it was above your ear. Yeah. And now that we got them at your ear, you're fine, right? Yeah. 
So here. I mean, I can still see it sometimes when it leaks up. I mean, I, I still hit the ball up there when I do it, but got better at it. So as long as it stays like at your ear or below, you're fine. Because that ball is high. I guess I got 88 on it. Cut. Cut. What does it say? Yo. This, yo. Like when I see those numbers, I just think about how I fucking when we hit for the first time, I was like fucking 81, bro. <laughs> Yeah, well. What? Yeah, you're just twice the hitter now. You've grown. No, you are. Because now you have the mental capacity to handle it. You were just young before. And the first time you hit was when you were 12, not last winter. We got right there. Hell yeah. They're high and velo, but they're not going that far. You'll get it. I'm not getting that back. Just, look, sound first, and then we'll get the spin, right? And then from there, the speed, and then how far it's going to go, okay? So that sound is getting consistent. Now the spin's starting to go up a little bit. Now, as you learn how to spin the ball by staying this way, I think if you let your top hand stay on a little bit longer, the spin's going to go up. But that sounds good. That was a hell of a pill. He's squaring everything up so much, like square, square. Ninety six. And that one two thirty, remember the other one was two sixty and ninety two, right? So the back how many RPMs? Yeah, but it's still like two seventy. Right? How far you go? Two thirty eight. Or two thirty eight. Yes. Give me those all day long. Look, the more we can match playing on soft toss and T. Right, as soon as the ball starts coming with BP, the ball's gonna start to go up. That was like a lot of my hits. Was like between the first baseman and the second baseman? One more, and I'm gonna go beeps for you guys. Yeah. Bye, bro. He just rushed that a little bit. When he finishes with his hand down here, that's when he's in trouble. See, his chest never got to that full. What was the video, like 92? That's just like, I really thought about not turning this in here. You know what I should right there? Really good job. Does that feel better? Yeah. Take him for beeps.